what's up guys today is friday finally friday there's the man bright sunny day here in mississippi so let's take a look and see what's on the snap-on truck today you guys come on Glad you are here. Because when you come, that means it's almost over. Almost. Well, you got a couple of things left that you ordered in for the meetup. Yeah, we uh, we went through a lot of stuff at the meetup. It was we had a lot of fun. It was great meeting everybody. Mm -hmm. Met some uh, interesting people, for sure. And uh. So yeah, I had fun. I was glad to meet everybody. <laughs> What'd you think about the band? That they was very good. Yeah, it's, it's awesome. been a while since I heard them play. And, uh, <laughs> but yeah, they was just like I remembered though. They was very good. Yep. They'll be back next year too. Is that what we'll see? Yeah, yeah. We didn't got them booked. I had them pencil us in. I told them to come back. So. Yeah. I think everybody. Guess it's on them, them now, then. Ain't it? <laughs> <laughs> you have to show everybody what hats you got. Cause we, uh, yeah, we ordered in a, a bunch of different hats, of course. We've had these before, mm -hmm. the Silver the 100th anniversary on there. Uh, and of course, here's the different color ones that we've ordered in for the show. Oh, we've got an cool. orange and a yellow, I mean, and a the blue. They're all pretty good. Yeah. Actually, I thought these would be like the main three gone, mm -hmm. and I was wrong. That was the bottom three out of all of them that we had. Your the one and you're the, wearing was like, the it's main funny, one. When Hamilton got there that morning, I told my wife, I said. I want to get one of those hats that yeah. Hamilton's got on. And uh, we got busy. Like, I, I, I didn't film any. I didn't do anything other than just meet the people that come and hang out with them because I thought that was the right thing to do, you yeah. know. And then by the end of the evening, I said, go out there and get me one of them hats. And she got tied up. And then when Trisha got here, I said, hey, will you grab me one of those hats? And she's like, they're all gone. Yeah, these, the ones <laughs> like these are here, uh, just regular snapback hats. Uh, went r very fast i was shocked um uh, i was here everybody always asked like hey give me fitted hats on on a fitted hat yeah i have zero luck with fitted hats i didn't order but 12 of these just because right and i still got nine of them left nine wow you know, and ordered 20 of them <laughs> these are here of course I'm, i should have ordered 100 of them because those right there were really cool these are very popular yeah. and i ordered them for the women it was kind of i mean to me it looks more like a women's hat with the design and color and stuff but a lot of guys bought mm -hmm. them too uh, the old school looking hats yeah these are nice i actually got one of these for myself with the gold on the bottom of them that it wears pretty good too and the uh, faded camo one i thought was really cool too. They, yeah i you ordered good on those yeah i ordered a couple dozen of them and I ordered more of these than anything, and I sold more of these than anything. Yeah, yeah those I only are got cool two too. of them left. Uh, of course, yeah, we I had them. a, <clears throat> I had a ton of fun, and I know everybody was happy to. It's all like, man, I finally got to meet Hamilton. Yeah, because there's a lot of people that came last year. Then I wasn't here last year. Of course, year. Hamilton laid down, and decided to go boating last year. <laughs> you know, and laid down on us, and uh, missed the fun, but. But uh, we took lots of pictures. It was and, good. Yeah, so it was, like I said, I, I had a blast. And um, I mean, it's kind of weird taking pictures with everybody because to me, like, I'm just tool salesman, you know? <laughs> just the road. The celebrity. Like, of the yeah, Prentice County. And then everybody comes up here and they all want pictures and stuff, which is cool. I had fun. I'm And, and what was cool, did. we met some really cool people from, yeah. from, from Kentucky. And one of them <laughs> had, had the hots for Hamilton. And I think I think he blushed a little bit. She did her job. She made him blush a little yeah. bit. So. And, and her husband was standing right there too, but he didn't care. <laughs> <laughs> I think everybody that come had a good time. Yeah. And we had a lot of great people here. Like That's what really the, I told Clay. I felt bad at the end of the night. Me and Clay was sitting here. It was probably what, 11 or so before. It was after that before I even left. Yeah. And almost everybody was gone by this point, except just uh, probably the main five or six people that 
you always hang around with and stuff. And uh, that's what I felt bad because, I mean, we were busy all day long. I mean, there's people on and off the truck. Mm -hmm. There's at times, they just like as that one of my busiest stops where it's 10 or 12 guys on the truck at one time. Uh, and there was 10 or 12 people on here at one time and I couldn't talk with everybody. Some, I, under, some did get a little bit frustrated and got off the truck after a few minutes. And like the ones I found, I apologize to the ones I didn't find. Um, I guess it's your own damn fault for not coming back where I wasn't <laughs> any more busy. I ain't gonna no, apologize now. Um, but that might There was a lot of people everybody. like, man, he is just like he is on video. I said, dude, I'm, what, what you guys see on these videos is 100% raw. Yeah. Like, it is what it is. I'm, yeah, I'm real. I'm going to tell how it is <laughs> and everything. I mean, I've told some of them on the truck Saturday, like, hey, I mean, I'm not trying to be an asshole or anything, but uh, we I mean, kind of got moved along where there's 20 people right here. Yeah. I'm, I looked out one time where I had to jump off and go take a pee break. I know, there was a line. And there was a people. line outside yeah. the truck out here. <laughs> and uh, I was like, I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, but yeah, I mean, I had a blast. It was it was a lot of fun meeting everybody and stuff. Yeah, it That's was. That's why I, I wish we had more time to be able to, uh, where I could have met everybody that was wanting to talk about just mm -hmm. anything. I met an interesting couple from just here in Mississippi, Laurel, Mississippi. Yeah. I talked to them a while. They was pretty cool. Yeah, uh, the ones everybody Kentucky. that came was super awesome. Yeah. Like I could hang out with the people that came here for a long time. Yeah, like, they was all like nobody showed up that I wouldn't say those people were cool. Yeah, you know, like, or wouldn't say that they weren't cool because yeah. what, everybody far? that showed up was awesome. Like, Some come from Illinois and Maryland. Ohio, Maryland, yeah, uh, Texas, and you know, um, Paige. Remember the girl that got the snap-on hat and stuff, Paige. Yeah. Dude, she was super cool. Like I met some of the coolest yeah, people. Yeah, I got this her year. a business card up here. Yeah, right here. And uh, yeah, I mean, she was cool. Her husband was cool. They brought their dog with them. Yeah, that they was from uh, Dallas. The yeah. couple that had the dog. Yeah. Yeah, they was pretty cool. It was awesome. Um, I don't think he messes with tools a whole lot. I think it's more her. Mm -hmm. But she was telling me that she got like five or six snap-on boxes. She says it's an L shape down. Once I have her carport and all the way down the back wall and she wants wow. to add on to it, she said, they're all full. She said, I ain't, I ain't got no more room. I need to add on more boxes in there. So I thought that was cool. Yeah. And she, I mean, she's not even a mechanic. She just yeah. works on her own stuff. That's good enough. And, uh, but probably, I say here, probably 70% of the people that was here or even more wasn't mechanics. They was mm -hmm. HVAC guys. They was, yeah. uh, Lawn mowing company guys, guys come machinists through. come through. I mean, there's other salesmen that came through that just, mm -hmm. there's a dude over at, uh, I know his dealer, just on the other side of Birmingham over there, older fella. I stepped off the truck for a second. He come walking across the parking lot with authority, had on the snap-on shirt, snap-on hat. I was like, who in the uh, hell is this James dude Green. right here? Yeah. yeah. I might thought he was another cool dealer. He was man. cool as could be. Yeah. He kept uh, trying to get me to wire this maroon, I'm sorry, crimson i'm like dude it ain't gonna happen he's yeah. like yeah 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 oh yeah he was a alabama fan it yeah. ain't happening man his mom and daddy probably laid it a little bit but <laughs> <laughs> he probably laugh at that yeah. sure. <laughs> but i tell you what um every I, like i seen he was drinking bud light of course we bought you know some bud light too and so every time i seen him get one out of or every time i went to get one i got him one yeah and then he got behind a little bit he was one beer behind me i'm like come on you're gonna have to catch up and then he's like, all right. He flipped that nitro switch on and he run with me there. Yeah. I said, we got to drink all these Bud Lights because like, they'll, be, right they'll be here forever if we don't. They ain't going to be no good next year they, when you come back. They ain't going to. see you. They won't be drinking unless you drink them, you know. I, we was talking with him. He hung, him and his wife hung out here late. She was cool, too. Both of them was very cool. They give give each other hell. That's for damn sure. <laughs> that was funny. Well, I hope and, uh, that people bought Michelob Ultra stock pre-meetup. Yeah. Because they had to go up. I had to. <laughs> had to go up. We went there was, through, I think it was 10 cases. I know Friday night we was up there hanging out. Of course, uh, even earlier Friday, when we ate lunch and stuff. <clears throat> they was filling up the coolers, but nice in them. Um, what, they had two, three, four coolers? Mm -hmm. And there was, I mean, it wasn't no yeti 45s there's like a <laughs> yeti 65 then there's one that was literally yeah. the length of this tow box it was 180 quarts or yeah. something like that i mean it was, it a was big one. Yeah. yeah somebody said something about moving and i started laughing i said ain't moving that big said, you gotta leave it where it's at yeah you gotta drink it down first like even at the end of the night i had brent help me 
drag it to the door so we could drain the water out of it. Yeah. And they was probably eight beers left. So they did yeah. pretty and good. People they that don't estimated know, about right. People that don't know Brent, Brent's about 6'8", 325. He's a big old fella. Brent's one of them fellas that gets a hold of you, you know it. Yeah, like, you, you ain't even no run no out about I'm it. I'm going to be like a dog, roll over and show my belly, my weak side. <laughs> <laughs> Just rub my belly. <laughs> yeah. He can get a kick out but of it. But I tell you what, we had a fine time. I wish right. I could afford to do that twice a year, to be honest with you. Yeah. If I could afford to do it twice a year, that's what we'd do twice a year. I know, of course, I mean, being on this side of it, I see a lot of stuff that the people on that side of the screen don't see. Mm. So I was saying, I mean, you've been working on this for a year. Yeah been a year going into this well i tried to get the and band then, last year to play i called them three months ahead of time i'm like i want y'all memorial day weekend that saturday dude we're, we'd book out for a year yeah i'm like we'll book me for next year you know and then yeah. they told me the price and i was like whoo it's a good thing because it took me about took a year it took to, a year to pay for, it. <laughs> pay for it yeah i mean i know what the band cost is on it i know what the food cost is on it for feeding 100 plus people yeah uh, it was a good time i know what the alcohol cost was on it yeah. and people i don't know uh the ones that was fortunate enough to go out with friday night thursday paid, night we started thursday yeah. yeah clay paid for all that stuff too yeah. and uh, of course is that our typical mexican joint up here we got the best waiter in the world yeah uh, he took care of everybody real good it was awesome like i i loved it i had a great time and I'm looking forward to next year because we're going to make it bigger and better. I've already had like three requests from different companies wanting to come in. Yeah. And, and you know, so it's just going to get bigger every year. So that's good. That's what uh, my wife, like she was, she was busy. So she was up here later on in the day. And that's what she asked, like, how's everything going? Like, I mean, I've been super busy and I probably could have been a whole lot more busier if I had somebody else that would oper that would, could do the money side of it and let me yeah. talk to people. That's what you need uh, to do next year. Yeah, that's what she said. She's like, well, next year, yeah. she said, I come, and I just, like, you just tell me on everything. And she can take a 60% cut. She can do the money cut. part of it. <laughs> well, she, that's better than what it normally is. She gets 100 now. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like, every week, I, I get around my money, and I just put my hand back out. I and finally like got 20 to or 30 answer bucks, right? the question. I was waiting on somebody to answer this, or ask this Saturday during the meetup. It was that evening. So I said, I just want to know something. How did Hamilton get to park up here, right next to the building, and plug his truck in? So tell them the reason why. Like tell them the whole the whole reason why Hamilton gets to park up front. Because I'm the OG. I was here first. Uh, when Clay called everybody, hey, y'all want to come out here? And all the other tow trucks say they're lied about stuff or whatever. I came out here. I put the time in and stuff. And that's Hamilton what, uh, was the first one yeah. when everybody else was like, no, 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 take six, eight, ten weeks to make up their mind to do a video. Yeah. Like me and Hamilton was getting ready to come on the truck one day, and I said, hey, do you want to shoot a video? He's like, yeah, yeah, I don't care. Yeah, I don't so, care. So, fine with me. And I, like I said, I'm not going to name any names, uh, but I mean, I was here in the shop with other folks pulled up, and Clay said, like, when uh, SLB was here and uh, Wally, he's like, if I can't shoot a video, I'm not going on the truck. And I did. And Clay asked me, he's like, you don't let me shoot a video? No, I don't feel comfortable with that. He's like, all right, that's fine. We went back over to the table and sit down and <laughs> yeah. shot the shit some more, you know? I yeah. mean. So that's you know. the way it happened. And as, as long as we do this event, and if Hamilton wants to park inside and let the band set the cooler on the, the back uh, lift gate of the, yeah, we the truck, that. that's what we'll do next hey, year. Next year we might put the band on the lift gate back here. <laughs> It, uh, and that's what yeah. I tell everybody. It's like, you know, Hamilton was the first one that gave me a chance. And as long as he wants to come to the event, he will have the VIP parking spot. It was it was funny, too, when I pulled up Saturday because out of all the tool trucks, I was the last tool truck here. Uh, you beat me here. I did beat Clay here. We, we left here late Friday <laughs> night, though. I did, did beat Clay here. And, uh, of course, everybody else was parked all around the edges and stuff, which I already knew where they was going to be at. And uh, I pulled right up here to the front. And that's what I told him. I said, dang. Of course, I got out and I was looking at me like, that ain't where you're supposed to park at. And I, hollered across, I was like, I forgot my keys. I can't even unlock the door to plug my truck in yet. <laughs> and I had to throw a little jab in there on them. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it's funny. We, get, we all get along. I know all of them. So yeah. <clears throat> we all have fun with each that's other. That's what everybody says. Like, they wouldn't know arguing between two trucks. I said, no, dude, it ain't even like that. I was like, they ain't. I yeah, said, they don't hate each other. It's just, it all boils down to... 
which dealer does the best for his customer and that's i, I did think it was funny i don't say who it was but one of them, the other tow truck's wife was over here for half the day just talking asking questions about the truck and all kind of different stuff that was <laughs> thought that was pretty interesting that's funny but they was all cool though we all hung out for a while afterwards and yeah. it was a great day like if you guys didn't show up next year or this year i promise you you missed one awesome time yeah it was a great day and next year it's going to be bigger and better because we've already kind of seen stuff that we we learned from the first meetup and then we learned from the second meetup so each one's going to be a little better and bigger and and now there's people calling me companies calling me like hey you guys doing this next year yep well what do we got to do to get signed up how do we come yeah I'm like, Just and show uh up. i mean i was going to tell you if you came this year you won something for free yeah because there's so much free stuff we gave away out here mm -hmm. just by the sponsors not from the trucks all the yep. trucks that i know of gave us stuff away too but just by the sponsors herself mm -hmm. uh clay had the big table in here set up that had i mean i don't know how many things was on the table yeah, i think i think we kind of hit it pretty lucky like almost every i think everybody, everybody that did show up probably won yeah. at least one thing so and, uh, yeah i mean that was pretty cool that mm -hmm. had that much stuff to give away and I had a lot of people reach out to me after that was over, like, man, I didn't know you was going to do giveaways. We'd have sent this. We'd have sent this. I said, well, next year it's going to be the same time, same bat channel. So, yeah. <laughs> you know, it is what it is. So, it, yeah. Just and that's what, uh, and I, uh, I know the game plan was this year was everybody to close at forward band started. I yeah. didn't get off the truck. It was like 545 before I got off the truck because when at four o'clock when I was looking, I was like, all right, we'll be done here in a few minutes by 415. I still had numerous people on here. And I, so I just looked outside and there was still a line of people outside. And I was like, I, mean, I can't close down now. I mean, <laughs> yeah. it was 5.45. I know some of the other tow trucks was already gone mm -hmm. before I got off the truck because the, uh, just the line of people out here. But oh, I was gonna say here and see all of popular. them. Yeah, starve to death and get eat all day about me. <laughs> <laughs> now I ate lunch with other people on here. So you guys make sure to plan next year Memorial Day weekend, which will be around the 29th of May again, it always is. Whatever Memorial Day is, that Monday, the Saturday before that is when we'll have the meetup. That way it gives yep. you a three day weekend. You can drive in on Friday. That's the only day you got to take off. Party Saturday, rest on Sunday, and drive home Monday, or drive home Sunday and rest on Monday. Yeah, it whatever you want to do. It's a perfect weekend. The I weather know. was great. We couldn't ask for better weather. A, a good buddy of ours, he, uh, he had too much fun Friday night, yeah. and he drove home Sunday. He said, uh, well, how far, four or five, six hours? About six hours. Yeah, he said it felt like 25 to 30. <laughs> <laughs> I felt bad for him. No, I didn't. I didn't feel bad for him. It was funny, though. He had and fun. for those of you that really like to party, like you got to be dedicated because me and Hamilton will give you hell if you oh, can't yeah. hang with us now. Yeah. Are you going to catch it? If you really like to party, Friday night is a is good the, time. Yeah. Like, it's a real good time. But let me warn you, don't be like some people and fall off the cliff because it's a long way down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tito. Tito will be oh, watching. Tito, he yeah. knows what we're That's talking right. about. That's right. Tito knows what we're talking yeah. about. Like, me and Hamilton's been doing this long enough, we know how to jump up there on about that eight beer yeah. buzz and just ride it out all yeah. night. Slow down, speed up, you gotta yep. do what you gotta do. Just maintain, uh -huh. that's what I call it, yeah. maintain. We brought a few extra drinks out here for some folks that don't ever get anything like that. Yeah. And uh, they all enjoyed that pretty good. Ken the lawn guy got to try yeah, real, Ken, homemade real homemade liquor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was interesting. <laughs> I, don't, I think that was the only time I seen him sitting down was that last hour over here. He was, he was fanning himself. He was like, whew. I was like, you all right? You're about to pass out over there. He's like, I'm hot. <laughs> yeah, all the girls was looking for hoodies and all that. <laughs> but this is two years in a row that instantly it was perfect weather for that yeah. Saturday. And oh, it Saturday right back was hot nice. Again, you know? Yeah. So. What was the high, like 67 or 68? I think it was maybe. projected 72, but I don't yeah. even know if it got up to 72, that. but it was perfect I weather for this. Well, that morning, I showed up in pretty much our T-shirt, but shorts on. And uh, shoot, it was a little cool that morning. And my Crocs. Everybody was, was laughing play. about my Crocs. Yeah. And then by the evening, they're like, well, my feet sore. I'm like, whew, I'm doing good. I, had, I bet I had 20 people ask on the truck, like, you really do wear Crocs? I said, I do wear Crocs. 
I mean, the only time I don't, I got tennis shoes on right now. That's because some shops I go to, which I understand for safety reasons. I'm not sure how these will protect my foot any more than what some Crocs will. Yeah. But, I mean, I don't make all the rules. I just got to abide by them for insurance reasons. Mm -hmm. But uh, Saturday, I yeah, have to, no rules to follow. So That's right. Or my Crocs. All so day. you can come next year rocking your Crocs and ain't nobody going to care. Because yeah. that's what we'll be wearing. Yeah. That's they need to make a sure. Croc with a bottle opener on it. I got them flip flops. Yeah, I think the, the reef flip flops yep. that's got them. So I got me a pair of them, but Croc I'm just needs a sponsor us and send us a few pairs. Yeah, Croc could make a special limited edition with a bottle opener. Yep. And uh, here we go. We'll sell. I will sell them. All we'll out sell here. tens of pairs of them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but that would be. We'll we'll rock them next year for the official. We'll open everybody's beer for them with our Croc. Yeah. They I don't might know. Them put it on the side or something. All I can tell so, them, they better have some damn good bottle openers because they had a workout Friday night and you, Saturday. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> if you're going to make them crock, you better make them good, is all I'm telling you. We don't you. call you out if they ain't. We'll go back to the old school crock. That's right. All right, guys. Well, we're going to get back here in the hell hole so we can finish up and call it a weekend. Like always, thank y'all for watching. If you missed the band playing, the live stream replay is on Diesel Medic, so check that out. It's well worth the time. It, it don't good. sound quite as good on there because it's shot through a little bitty microphone on a laptop, but hey, it was still awesome. Like always, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit that thumbs up. Check over here for merchandise, cool tools, and discount codes. And if you're not subscribed, you take your finger and click that button. Y'all have a great weekend. Catch you later.